This is the current results output. As you can see, it is not user friendly and is text heavy. We want to enhance the front end experience of the power tagging plugin that we have developed for the Embraco content management system. We will go through the four different designs in this video. Option one shows a similar design to the current power tagging plugin. The layout has been rearranged with an enhanced filtering system added. At the top, we have the search bar. As you can see, the search term definition is listed underneath the search field. More topics can be viewed by clicking on the More Related Searches button. This is similar to Flickr, where users are allowed to switch between simplified and advanced searching by expanding the search bar. The topics are categorised as Related Searches, Narrow Concepts and Broader Search for more concise searching. This design has filtering as its highest priority for users who are trying to find certain particular information in mind. The filtering system is featured on the left hand side. The filters are grouped together in tabs and can be expanded or contracted. There is also an additional order of results sorted by best match, title and date. The results are listed in a one column format, similar to other search engines such as Google and DuckDuckGo. This makes it easier for users to scan through information. This type of design is suited for users who are exploring a topic without the need to filter information. At the top, we have the search bar. As you can see, the search term definition is placed under the search field, just like in the first design. All topics are shown as visual images with no characterization between broader and narrower concepts. These arrow buttons allow users to click left and right to view more topics. The results are shown in a magazine grid layout, similar to Flipboard. The most popular content are shown at the top. There is infinite scrolling for results. No filter options are available as the design encourages users to scroll through content and explore. This is why the result content takes up the full width of the screen. This is option 3. Option 3 was designed to have related topics as the main focus on the results page. This encourages users to spend more time exploring where the subject images are at various sizes. The main search term is displayed as the biggest image. The images are positioned in relative proximity to the main search term. The closer the image is to the main search term, the closer the relationship is to the main topic. The size of the image refers to the amount of results available for that topic. The bigger the image, the higher the number of results. Infinite scrolling is available on both the related topics page and on the results list. The ordering of results is ordered by relevance, date and title. There is no other advanced filtering options available as we want users to explore related content rather than filter down. When you click on a selected topic, the right slider reveals the results list. By clicking on any of the content on the results list, a second slide will appear on the right. Closing this content slider will close all the sliders. Users can switch between content results and related topics by clicking on the relevant slider. This is option 4. This type of design would suit people who are searching for books, films, profile and all recipes. It is similar to option 3 but with a different related topics layout. Where the related topics are in circles. The search bar is similar the search bar is similar to many search engines such as DuckDuckGo and Google. There is a back button on the left hand side of the search field to allow users to go back to the previous search. The circles are similar to Last FM where you're able to hover over artist circles and play music from the selected artist. The circles are positioned in relative proximity to the search topic. The closer they are to the main circle, the closer the relationship is to the search term. The size of the circle refers to the size of results available for that topic. The bigger the circle, the higher the number of results for that particular topic. 
The order of results is sorted by relevant date and title, but there's no other filtering options available otherwise. Click, by clicking on the topic, a right slider reveals the list of results. Clicking on an item on this result list will result in a double slider showing the content and the result list. Closing this slider will close everything.